Can a shipping container house withstand a tornado? Most shipping containers are strong enough to withstand an F0 to F2 tornado. However, a moderate tornado can easily break windows, allowing air to flow into the house. If you want to learn about shipping container homes, and the impact of tornadoes on container homes, I will invite you to keep watching to the end. Because at the end of this video, you will learn how to increase structural integrity and protect your shipping container home against tornadoes. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe Cargo Home. As the name suggests, a shipping container house is built from shipping containers. The containers are arranged to create different floor plans and layouts. The containers can be placed in rows, side by side or stacked. The interior is finished with drywall, flooring and all the features found in a standard house. However, the metal frame can provide better protection against tornadoes and weather conditions. Shipping containers are incredibly durable, and built to withstand heavy wind and rain. A house built from these containers, can be expected to withstand harsh weather conditions. The frame of a shipping container can withstand the gusts of wind that a low to moderate force tornado can cause. However, windows, doors and certain exterior elements are less likely to survive. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe Cargo Home. But before we continue, let's take a look at this video that gives a deeper explanation of tornado and the Fujita we Pearson scale. We classify tornadoes on a scale called the Enhanced Fujita Scale. A gentleman by the name of Theodore Fujita came up with this classification system, and over time it's been modified. That's why it's now called the Enhanced Fujita Scale. And it rates tornadoes from EF0 all the way up to EF2. EF5. EF1 tornadoes have those winds of 86 to 110 miles per hour. Typically with an EF1 tornado, we see roofs that are stripped, mobile homes are overturned or badly damaged. That's why we urge people to leave. Thank you for tuning into our video and be sure to subscribe to Cargo Home. The U.S. has the most tornadoes in the world and some of the most destructive and deadliest. The U.S. has more tornadoes than anywhere else in the world, on average, around 1,200 tornadoes a year. F0 and F1 tornadoes account for 80% of the tornadoes in the United States. With a maximum wind speed of 112 miles per hour, or 180 kilometers per hour, an F1 tornado should not destroy a container home. The frame and roof can also survive an F2 tornado. An F3 tornado produces wind speeds up to 206 miles per hour, or 331 kilometers per hour, which can cause structural damage and potentially destroy containers. An F3 tornado is powerful enough to overturn trains and uproot most trees. Regardless of the type of property, a tornado presents a number of potential hazards. Here are some of the main ones in the order they tend to occur. Damaged roofing. Broken windows and doors. Internal air pressure. Structural damage. Flying debris. The roof is often the first part of the house to be hit by the tornado. In the case of a standard house, tornado force winds can tear off shingles and parts of the roof covering, weakening the roof. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe Cargo Home. Windows and doors can also break during a strong tornado. Once the windows are broken, the interior of the house fills with air from the wind created by the tornado. The internal air pressure builds up and presses on the ceiling. In a matter of seconds, the air pressure can lift the roof of the house. How do you protect a shipping container home from tornadoes? Compared to standard mobile homes and wood frame homes, a shipping container home should be a safer shelter in the event of a tornado. However, you can also take steps to increase the structural integrity of your shipping container home. Build your cargo home on a stable foundation. Consider building a basement. Choose DP50 windows. Use metal roofs. Two of the main factors that protect your container home during a tornado are the frame and the foundation. If you're wondering if a cargo home can withstand a tornado, make sure your container home is set on a stable foundation. You should also make sure that the containers are properly reinforced to increase their strength. Thank you for watching, and be sure to subscribe Cargo Home. You can also consider building a container home with a basement. Container homes are usually built on a slab foundation, but can also be placed on a basement foundation. Some container homes include basement spaces created from containers placed in the ground. Windows are often the most vulnerable areas of a home during a tornado. 
If you want to protect yourself from tornadoes, choose windows with a high DP rating. The DP rating measures the structural load of the window, its resistance to water and air infiltration. DP 50 windows can withstand a pressure of 75 pounds per square foot, 366 kilogram per square meter, which is equivalent to a wind speed of about 200 miles per hour, 322 kilometers per hour. Choosing metal roofs or asphalt shells should also improve the safety of your shipping container home. Metal roofing sheets can last longer than shingles in high winds. Thank you for tuning into our video, and be sure to subscribe to Cargo Home.